Uh, you know, Falcon Greninja. This seems like a very fast My favorite matchup. frog. Yes. Uh, small Battlefield, a nice solid starter. Thank God they have this as a starter. Screw NorCal for not having this as a starter, by the way. Uh, I don't know. Town and City looking kind of... <laughs> kind of different, huh? <laughs> I'm surprised that Up Smash connected, actually. That uh, doesn't work on Falcon much because of um, how his legs work. Yeah, uh, hurtbox shifting, right? Yeah. So, like, when you Up Smash him, his legs... Like, one, if you hit his right leg, uh -huh. specifically, it, he, uh, he just pops out. So he like he got him in the very perfect spot of the tech animation. Okay, for sure. Sometimes you just have to be precise like that and make up for your uh, characters, not flaws, but you know, the little match of intricacies. Yeah, exactly. Yuman very knowledgeable, already getting off the nice start, ninety percent. Yeah, I like the um, Tasha, I like this like weaving like in and out from Matt or Muman. Friends. Yeah, uh, friends. <laughs> friends. <laughs> That's dead. Yeah. See, he almost hit the leg, but he he barely missed. Did that charge help him out? Yeah, the charge did help him out because he caught him when he was coming up instead of when he was just idle. Got you. Makes sense. Yeah. Uh, these little tricks coming into play, but Malian has him off stage. Uh, smart recovery. Yeah. Sorry, not Malian. Pinkerton. God, tags oh. are so hard, man. <laughs> I think I'm just going to... I mean, I don't think he minds if we call him Malian. Yeah, we'll call him both. It's okay. Yeah. Nice triple up air coming out. Great yeah. convergence. I love the instant double jump on that up air. That's yeah. what makes that true. And, and this is what Muon's really great at. That he, was such a good bait. He keeps his opponent from ledge to ledge. Does not matter where they are. He's going to be in control. So Matt is, or er, Muon <laughs> is the, um, unlike the archetypes of Greninja, everyone calls me the patient Greninja, but Muon is the aggressive one. He's the one who will run in and gun you. Speaking of running in and gunning, wake up Falcon Kick. Yeah, the classic. A stable since 2001, man. Gotta love it. Ah, great up on the jump. Really love that. Mm -hmm. Right, yeah, we just got the ledge trapping. Good dash attack on reaction. He has him in the corner. Yeah, he's been in the corner for the majority of this game, uh, making his way out a couple times, but still being pinned no matter what. This Oh, this oh. ledge trapping is so good. Beautiful patience on the roll-in. Seeing Mumon back into form. Yeah, no, this is some great stuff. I know he's definitely had some uh, rough tournaments the past weeks. He's been trying to get himself back into form, but yeah. he's looking great right now. Yeah, he's been stuck in Rockford. He just hasn't been able to play the game. So, like, now that he's, like, he's just looking sharp as ever now. Yeah, this is really great stuff. I love it when Chicago players just put it. You can see it when they're putting the passion mm -hmm. in. You know? Not a lot of people know, or I guess some people know, but Mumon was probably, like, top one in Chicago for, like, a couple, di like, a solid, like, two weeks. Was that after the first Ignite in the first Dude, season? This is back? when he like this is when he like beat Ned, beat Quaz, oh, I remember beat everybody, that. Yeah, beat I ben. remember that. Yeah, definitely really great out of region. We can talk about that later. Mm -hmm. uh, Mumon taking game one really smoothly. I mean, yeah, I think Mali might have to a little, you know, maneuver around this a little bit. Get mm -hmm. his composure, don't really push too many buttons, just react and approach. The secret to the secret to this matchup is and Arcdice is really good at doing it against me and Mumon, for example, is you have to you, you can don't dash a lot because Greninja dash attack is really good at punishing Falcon's dashes, and Falcon dashing already is so committal because he can't turn around so easily. Yeah, dashing in ultimate means you're locked to a jump or like an attack, like a special or an up smash. And with Falcon, it's especially bad. Oh yeah, definitely. That forward air is gonna catch a dash right there. Oh man, same old song and dance, but you guys get the roll in, really nice. Yeah, I mean right now, so now it's this time it's Mumon at the ledge, but it's an interesting recovery. Yeah. He makes his way back to center using that big stage of Town and City to help him out. Yeah. What's scary about that, uh, like landing with a uh, Hydro Pump on stage, is it has 30 frames of end lag. Oh, that's no jump. Oh, misspacing the water. 30 frames. That's a lot. Yeah, that's <laughs> a lot. <laughs> wow. Okay. The only the only way around it is by canceling it with the ledge, but that's yeah. its own thing. Yeah, you gotta be in the right position for that. Mm -hmm. It's also very situational in itself. I like how both of these players are really cognizant of the dashes and jumps, but they're just mistiming it just by barely. I've been seeing a couple missed back yeah. airs. Nice snap. That was though. very good. Yeah. Yeah, forget what I was saying. They're, they're catching each other on. They just gotta warm up a little bit, you know? Mm -hmm. Winners round three, it's a little bit early. <laughs> oh, that's the me. The back hey. air dash. Oh, he tried oh. to hit him with the, the. I don't even know what that was, actually. Oh, the counter stalling him, not being able to get a grab because of the grab instead. Yeah, that was smart. The shadow sneak was interesting, though. Yeah. I've never. I don't ever see that app. That was really good. That yeah. was just. Ex like, exhausted every single possible option and then caught the last one that was available. Yep, Greninja 101, man. Yeah. Good grab. Yeah. Nair high, which is, I mean, not a lot of Greninjas do that in general, but it, it actually is, like, secretly kind of good. Because, like, if you Nair high, you can just combo up air. Gotcha. But it is very risky. It's, like, it's it's something that catches jumps in the moment. Gotcha. Great little string coming up from Yumon. Back at the ledge. Same old song and dance. We're going to get greedy? Ooh, no, he just lets him roll. Yeah, lets him go. Okay. Sometimes you got to get out of jail free card, you know? Just got to roll in. <laughs> Rolling out of the corner is actually, like, secretly really stupidly good. It is, yeah. You're not airborne. You can stay on the ground. Get the iframes, right? Just, like everything in Ultimate, don't be too predictable. Something like Leo does a lot. <laughs> Just rolling out of the corner. It's very, it, I mean, it's very effective for what it is. Oh! oh. That's always scary. That up smash that. is so scary. Down yeah. tilt, up smash. Uh, not high, yet, though. High ceiling. No worries. He's got time. Ooh. 
Both these characters are very prominent killing off the side, which Town is very prone to giving. I like the parry, but no punish. Okay, good roll, but uh, the frame trap? Frame trapping city, baby. Beautiful. Forwarder taking up the stock. He's got two stocks up to one. Yumon playing very hot right now. Jab lock? Uh, oh. Push him off. <laughs> Wake up Falcon Kick. Uh, he might be burning the cars a little bit too early. Good up out of shield. That like that up is so like deceptively good out of shield because people like to land and then shield immediately. Oh yeah, it's very good at catching that. Nice deep nair. That was really that was good. Really confident. I think maybe Mallory's getting his way back into this. Yeah, he's. I mean, he's not second guessing his options anymore. He's kind of just. He's committing. Yeah, exactly. I mean, when you're down 0-1 and it's only a best of three, you might as well yeah, just go in. Got the read. Oh, he's going oh, in. All right. Oh, this might be dead. No. Tech chase? Platform saves him. Very smart. If he jumped on the platform and nair, he could have gotten nair f smash. Oh. This character's so nasty sometimes, dude, <laughs> I tell you. <laughs> uh, oh, quick juggles. Nice frame two air dodge from Greninja, saving him from that conversion. Me? No. Dash attack. Good air Oh, he doesn't commit, though. Oh, God. Drag down. Oh, the tech. What a tech chase. Great damage. Not getting the stock just yet, but he's in a great position to take this game. Oh, my God. His dude, his advantage state is just so good. Ooh. All right, back at the ledge. What have you learned? Oh, he <laughs> had that, Reed. Oh, oh, that move is only oh, alive. alive. I did not expect that. That smash is so scary. Oh, though. my God. First time I've seen that move not kill? No way. Can we get a game three? Maybe. Can we get a downer here? No. That's a down tilt, and that should be it. Okay, yep. fun fact. That down tilt's active for only two frames, which yeah. is less than Roy Jab and Sephiroth the F tilt. That's yeah. a hard move to hit. If you hit it, you deserve that. For sure. I mean, it's also like, it's also one of those moves. I don't even know if it hits ledge. Uh, probably character dependent. Yeah, it Gren doesn't hit Greninja. No, though. no, good, good ledge hang. You're good. Roy Jab doesn't even hit Greninja at ledge. Really? Yeah. Even if he's really up close. Yeah. That's Roy terrifying. Jab just doesn't hit. <laughs> Man. I learned that, and I started doing that to revolver. I just hung. I just hang at the ledge. Yeah. Hanging at the ledge is really strong in this game because a lot of players just kind of wait for you to get back. But if you have something that can hit it, like. Were you down smash? You're chilling, man. It's very important though to mix up when you're going off ledge, though, because oh, you yes. like if you constantly mix that timing up, ledge trapping just becomes so much harder already. Because oh, yeah. most players, myself and probably you included, ledge trap a lot of reaction. Yeah. Oh no, for sure. Especially offline, I've been exactly a couple months, six or seven, right? So been ledge trap, tech chasing, all of it's typically reaction. I mean, for me specifically, I don't have to pay attention to what they're picking because I just react to what they're doing. Exactly. Um, oh, okay, this game three might be very polarizing because I see Kalos and I see Dude, Ninja Falcon. I, this is such an interesting stage. This stage, yeah, it could go either way. This yeah. is like both of these characters' best stage. Oh, that's that. Oh, that's such a good combo. Nice. I love seeing that always. Easy 30, still making it a 60. I wish he went for the second back there, though, off that air dodge. Oh, yeah, no. He, Mumon is, Mumon is advantage state is just so good. But, like, his issue is he's just not committing. Mm -hmm. Malian is taking some very safe conversions. Like, he's not trying to kill you. He's trying to get you in a bad spot, which is not bad. But on Kalos, you gotta go crazy sometimes, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Maybe he's saving for the back pocket. We'll see. Uh, deep dive? Nothing too crazy. Nothing. Can we get a neutral get up here? Yeah. Oh, there's the Falcon Kick, though. He's ready. And like you were saying before, exhausting the cards. Yeah. You don't want to show your cards too early, especially in the best of three, man. Is even in the best of five, the higher up you get, the more important those mix-ups become. Oh yeah, those are your lifelines right there. Oh tech? my god, great Good tech. tech. Oh, but he, that's at 30 frames of end lag. I'm so, he actually could have down smashed that. Oh yeah, no, no, no. Being knowledgeable of what thing has, has lag in this game is so, so yeah. important. Because nothing really has lag, but there's some few moves. Nice down tilt forward yep. there. The classic. Oh, here we go. I want to see, I want to see Mewmon play this patient. Because this is a mat This is one of those matchups where you have to play patient and be ready to whiff punch everything Falcon does, especially when he jumps like that or dashes. Agreed. And when you're jumping or dashing, you're putting yourself in a bad spot. And you do not want to die on Kalos. I love. I I know what he was going for. He was trying to probably get dragged down up air after the the up throw nair. Mm -hmm. I love the intention. What's the timing? Immediate. Nice mix. Nice. Yeah. He was he usually he was holding on for like two seconds, but that time he just pulled it immediately. Good stuff. We've been talking about it. ledge options are so important for both these characters and in ultimate in general. Especially yep. the timing. These are the frame traps coming out from Mewmon. Nice. What do we got? Wow, okay. we got that? Impressive. So Malian's been neutral get upping a lot, but he's been mixing up his timing with it. What? Oh, In the okay. I... Uh, go off, King. Yeah, go off, King. Go, do what you gotta do. All right. Two oh, what is he? Okay, okay, okay. He's okay. going okay. nuts. He wants this three-stock. He wants to end this right off now. Mewmon is on fire. Oh, no jump? Oh, good tech in place. Or tech run. Sorry. That was good. I thought he was going to shadow sneak and steal the game right there. Oh! You monster. He wanted to end that game after the first stock. And you know what he said? You're not Dude. killing me. I'm killing you. I would never do that. I, I'm oh. too scared. 
So I'm talking about Rockford has some legends, and they don't come out enough, but R Mumon showing up right now. Rockford actually currently, if we're talking technical terms, houses three PR players in Chicago. Uh, we have Seth, we have Animal Kingdom now, yes. and we have Mumon. Yes, yes, yes. Such good players, dude. Yeah.